Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. So I want to make us a, a um, beef hoagie, and this is the whole kit. It's got the bread, sauce, cheese, and meat with it. And the beef with it. You pick these up at um, I got mine at Kroger's, but you can pick them up anywhere. Kroger's, Walmart's. They also have um, other kinds too. I think I got like that. A chili, a chili, uh, Philly steak too. You could get a Philly cheesesteak sauce, which I gotta get hot water on that. That's the patty. Yum. And these are really good. We've had these before. The buns. And the cheese. I've had it sitting out for a little while. Trying to get the unthaw. And I just go by like packages. I think I just put the patties in first. See, place the sauce in some water. Hot water, which is what I got right now. And then place frozen fully cooked beef hoagie patties on a in a pan. Wait, so let me get my sauce and then I'll show you. Okay, now I'm saying to you, you put these in the oven for 10 minutes. Just place them on here. And then after these are in for about four minutes, you put your buds. Or something like that. But anyways, at the final end, you'll have the whole sandwich placed in you. At the very end, don't worry. You'll have the whole sandwich in there, heating it up. So, you can kind of do it, you know, however you want. Okay, guys, now we take these out. Make sure you get your bottle because it's going to be real hot. <laughs> I'm not doing it quite as. Why is this pan warping up? Look at it. That is weird. I've never seen it do that before. And it wasn't warped when I put it in. Oh, well, maybe it's cheap. Okay, so I've had this all soaking. So what I'm going to do now. Is cut this off. Open. I'll move you guys a little closer. And I'm gonna put the sauce and cheese on. Stick it back in just up for a few seconds, long enough for the cheese to melt. And then I'll, I'll. Uh... Oh, these hoagies smell good. These are good hoagies. I'm telling you. Um, and then I'll, I'll make them and then put them back in and let the buns get a little brown. Voila, you have yourself a hoogie. You can also put, um, these are called, uh, they call them beef hoogies, but they call them, if you order them like around in a store or something, restaurant, they're called pizza. Pizza hoagies. Or steak hoagies, I mean. Okay. And then we always put pizza sauce, cheese. And you also put pickle, lettuce, whatever you want. If you wanted to. Sometimes we will do, uh... What did I do that for? I need the scissors still. Sometimes we will do pickle on it. If I ordered one, I'll put pickle on it. You know, like out and about. Pickles, it will be. Yes, yes, yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah. We'll do some cheese here. I'm gonna put some cheese evenly. 
I think I should spread that out first. Sauce a little bit here. I think. Yeah, they give you lots of salt, so. They're not going to be dry, trust me. Mm -mm. Man, that sauce is good, too. I ain't quite got my cheese thawed out, though. all the cheese on it evenly or if you like little cheese just put little cheese you don't even have to use it all if you don't want to but y'all know me <laughs> I love my cheese so therefore it all gets put on there Put these back in long enough for the cheese to melt and then we'll make them up. It's long enough, so it shouldn't take a uh, very long at all. And in the meantime, we'll get our mess up cleaned up. I don't think I'll make nothing else with it. Okay, guys, so they're done. Let's do the best. Best is fine. No doubt, even more, so we ain't gotta worry about it. Yeah, I'm gonna be. Okay. Do you your buns? My buns. These are super delicious. I'm telling you. Delicious. Gotta be careful to make sure. Of course, they're not gonna come open. Like they're supposed to, because they're probably the first. that four times and we'll have all of our sandwiches done. Yeah they're still frozen. About right there in the middle. Frozen. That way. You don't have to dirty up a whole lot of pants, you know. Makes a whole lot of sense to me. You like you are. I got about four loads of laundry, you. Okay, we'll put them back in for 
Mm. I can dance. See from there. What happens? You want the buns. Make some taste good that way. There you guys have it. JTM steak hoagie, hot rod out of the oven. And I'm telling you, these things are delicious. I had a pickle. You can also add onion. Usually I get onion too if I order them out. So good. Mm -mm.